Just six days before the election, Vice President Kamala Harris rallied supporters in Harrisburg today as polls show the race in the Commonwealth as a dead heat. Thanks for joining us for this late edition of Fox 43 News. I'm Amy Lutz. I'm Evan Forrester. Fox 43's James Corrigan was at the rally in Harrisburg and recaps the Vice President's message. The next President of the United States, Kamala Harris. Vice President Kamala Harris rallied her supporters in Harrisburg just six days before Election Day with a message focused on unity following rhetoric stemming from her opponent, former President Donald Trump. Unlike Donald Trump, I don't believe people who disagree with me are the enemy from within. He wants to put them in jail. I'll give them a seat at the table. The vice president made her first visit to South Central Pennsylvania during the campaign and laid out her economic agenda to her supporters inside the giant expo hall at the Farm Show Complex. I will give a middle class tax cut to 100 million Americans, enact, enact the first ever federal ban on price gouging on groceries, and fight to make sure that hardworking Americans can actually afford a place to live. Harris's supporters were enthusiastic throughout the evening, each with their own reason to back the Democratic nominee. I have two young daughters, and this is more important than anything else in the world right now, making sure that they have freedom. I think she is easy to understand in what she wants done, and I think what she wants to do is smart. Harris referred to Trump as unstable and attacked him for the repeal of Roe v. Wade. She implored her supporters to turn people out to vote for her, even those they disagree with on issues. In the Six days, let us please be intentional about building coalition and let us remember we all have so much more in common than what separates us. And the rally came as three different polls of Pennsylvania that were released today showed the race tied between Harris and Trump. The vice president saying that her supporters cannot afford to stay on the sidelines as it could be the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania that decides the president in just six days' time. At the Farm Show Complex, I'm James Cargan with Fox 43 News.